Good morning, everybody. Yeah, I started recording just as the sound started for morning time. This is Syntic coming to you with my Terraria Let's Play. Uh, as I said last time, we're going to finish up this house and hopefully get a merchant uh, like as soon as we finish the house. Um, let's see here. Oh, you d oh, do you know what mistake I made a second time? I went off exploring with my big pile of money, I think. I think if I look in here... Oh, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay. I was worried there for a moment. I was, I was worried that I just lost all my money. All right. So, let's see here. We have my door. We have my table. And we have my chair. All right. Let's uh, put the door down. Let's put the table down. Oh, that's not where I wanted the table. There we go table and chair and every room needs a light source so there we go uh, do I have anything in this chest yet no I do not so let's go ahead and break open the chest and put the chest in here no I don't want the chest there I want the chest there yeah there we go there we go where's my merchant he's not here yet all right well uh, what to do what to do what to do what to do I really didn't plan on what to do after I built that house. That house worked out a lot faster. I was hoping the merchant would arrive. Like a, I was hoping as soon as I finished it would be like, Merchant has arrived! So I guess let's go over here, get some more wood. Yeah, wood. Oh, you know what I can do? Where's where's my inventory? Where's, where's my wood? Dirt block. There we go. There we go. Yeah. We're going to take my pickaxe out. And... Dig right there. Then we're going to dirt, 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 dirt. There we go. Okay. Now, where's my trees? There's, there's, there's my trees. Okay. We want a tree right, right, right there, right, right there. That's I want it right there. Oh, I guess it has to be on grass. Well, that's unfortunate. Because the only way I know to get grass over there is to make enough dirt to connect it with the nearest grass, which would be right here. And that's not going to happen in any, any time in the near future. The other way is to go and buy some from the dryad, grass seed set is, and build an amazing uh, farm using a little bit of that grass seeds problem with that though is what I understand is you got to beat a boss to get the dryad to come and I don't think I have what it takes to beat a boss yet uh, so my, my, my plan here to walk a little ways away from the house um, and hope that the merchant would arrive the moment I stepped off screen that didn't work for me so we're just gonna cut some wood down here and then we're gonna go back and uh, maybe go back down into the pits. Sounds like a good plan. Because I still need to kill a skeleton and take his hook. I still need to gather a lot more iron, a lot more silver, and a lot more gold. Um, but I want a good supply of wood here so that I'm not worrying about... Worrying about lighting the way. These things are trying to start shit with me again. What the heck? I've never, I've never seen a slime this small. It's a pinky. How much health does he have? Whoa! What the fuck? All right, well, I'm sorry, guys, for swearing at you like that. But Pinky has 150 total health. It's a good thing I have my iron sword. I'm killing Pinky. Maybe Pinky's like a mini boss, and he's got some awesome loot. I've never seen a Pinky before. Not in any videos. I, I like I saw a video by Marvin that said uh, Marvin versus Pinky or something like that, but I didn't finish watching it yet. Um, oh yeah, I did promise you guys to look up uh, the names of various uh, um, people that are making good Let's Plays out there. Um, I don't really have names for you yet because I keep on starting the 
recording the moment that I turn it off because there's just so much going on. Um, but uh, I do know Marvin's one of the ones that are making some YouTube. Uh, let's see if I can speak my English. That's all, folks. Yeah, uh, no, it's not. Um, yeah, Marvin has named his character after uh, what? What is it? Uh, Marvin the Green Martian. For I'll let him explain that to you. You should go watch his things. Look up Marvin's Let's Plays. Um, I watched a little bit of it, and it seemed interesting. But I don't have an infinite time amount in the day, so I can't watch everybody's Let's Plays. Um, let's see here. Who else? There's a there's a girl gamer that's uh, doing some Let's Plays of it. And she's doing it blind. She uh, did not watch a significant amount of other people's Let's Plays. Um, so she's she is having some problems learning how to do some basic things. But this game really doesn't have a good tutorial, so I'm not I'm not not razzing on her at all because this game it would be very complicated for me had I not watched a shit ton of uh, videos prior to making these. Uh, but uh, let's hear who else is there. There's uh, hmm. I don't. I don't really have many more names for you. I know there. There's another person that I've been watching pretty regularly, uh, other than Pbat. That is. Um, but I just. I can't remember his name at the moment. Um, I'll get it. I'll get it to you guys though. I promise. Come on, change to my sword. There we go. Yeah, nine damage versus two damage. Just. Just a little bit of a different fight there. Do I have enough wood yet? Do you guys, do you guys think I have enough wood? How much wood do I got? I got 187. That that should be enough wood for now, right? I mean, I don't think I need a, sh a shit ton of wood. Why isn't my merchant here yet? Oh, a merchant has arrived. Did that? Did, did I start saying that when that was already on the screen? I think I said that when that was already on the screen. Let's go talk to the merchant. Let's go talk. What what was that? Oh, oh, I know what that was. I thought that was a monster. Just a second. I Yeah, that's my boots. My speed boots. I need a lot of level ground though for it to cuz jumping apparently turns it off. Well, that's stupid. There's not enough level ground in this game for Oh. You know what I'm going to do? I got an idea, guys. I've got plenty of wood now. I could build a platform up into the sky and go left and right. Maybe encounter some uh, floating islands. And since the platform will be all level, I will be able to get from one end of the map to the other really fast with my speed boots. Does that sound like a good idea? I'm not going to do it this episode. Um, but... I will probably do it maybe next episode or something. Um, if not next episode, soon. Um, I might even do the basics of the platform off screen. Um, because I don't know exactly how I'm going to go about making it. But we'll find out. Ooh, let's see here. Shop. Uh, I already have an anvil. He wants 8 gold for the helmet. Uh, 20 copper for shurikens. What do we, do we got here? We got Topaz. We'll sell him Topaz. How much is 20 silver per or for the Topaz? Uh, let's rearrange things. Let's go get my money. No, not the nurse. There we go. Where's my money? There we go. Got lots of money now. Uh, and then I got... I got enough to make a silver coin here. There we go. All right, now what, did I have anything in there that? Ooh, 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 ooh. Where, where am I? I gathered stars. Oh, here they, here they are. Here they are. I can make a mana crystal now. Okay. Sorry if I seem like I'm getting distracted, but you do have to do a bit of inventory management in any role-playing style game. So you're just gonna have to bear with me here, just a moment, while I do this. Let's see here. I didn't gather any ores. Let's go ahead and put my ores away. Uh, let's see here. Iron ore. There we go. 
mushrooms, put these down here in my healing row of spare stuff. Seeds, put those in there. Uh, red brick building materials. Let's see here. That's that's about it from that chest there. What do we got? We got a sword that I can sell. Extra pair of boots. Some arrows that I'll probably never use. Yeah, yeah. That's uh. This seems like a decent, uh, let's see here, we'll put the stone blocks in there. Uh, combine those two piles though of them. Um, got a clay brick, got more sand, mud bricks. Uh, let's see here, dirt blocks, keep those. Put the acorns in here too. Copper bricks can go in here. There we go. This is looking a lot better now, a lot better. Let's go talk to this merchant. Did we have anything in that chest here? Nothing in this chest. Okay, merchant, shop with me. Shop with me. What do we got? What do we got? We got a piggy bank. That's what I want the piggy bank. I'm going to spend my one gold on a piggy bank. Um, and you can have the boot. Ooh, the boot covered my piggy bank. All right. Sell those arrows. Sell the wooden sword. Sell the copper sword. And there we go, yeah. Now, let's go back over to my piggy bank. Or, X to that, you get onto my piggy bank. Get out of the way, merchant. Put the piggy bank in there. There we go, there's a reason why I'm putting the piggy bank in here. It's to move my money in here, right next to the merchant. And that way, I will never be without money. Why'd I put it in that location? There we go. Now, come back over here, grab my bars. Oops. See, ahead of time, I had already thought of how I was going to sort stuff. Stuff. I'm just getting it all in the order that I imagined here now. Uh, oh, I should have grabbed while I was over here the ores also. There we go. There we go. Mm, what? No, not that chest. The piggy bank. There we go. There we go. Where is it? Here we go. Yeah! Yeah! Perfect! Perfect! Look at that! Look at that amazing inventory! Alright. So, uh, yeah. What now, guys? Uh, I guess I could build another house and maybe a demolitionist will move in? That sounds like a plan. So, we need my building materials. And where are my building materials? We got gray bricks here. Oh, don't drop them. I want them in my inventory. There we go. Stones. Stones. I uh, don't have enough copper to make copper walls. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Make as many gray bricks as we want. Because regular stone, I don't need it. I don't need regular stone. The only reason why I need regular stone is to make bricks of various types. <sighs> I wish I could just click and hold. So maybe if red and blue are watching this, though I seriously doubt that they are, but if they are, maybe that they could listen to this and say, hey, clicking and holding sounds like a great idea. Alright, so then we come back over this way, drop on down, and where's where's my pickaxe? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. There we go. Now where's my where's my stone? What? I just I just made a bunch. Where did it... There we go. There we go. Perfect. There we go. Now we need a door, table, and chair. Door, chair, sign, table, sign, there we go. Oh, while I'm right here, might as well build my 40 back wall. Where's my back wall here? Gray brick back wall. There we go. That can go in place of the... We'll put it right there for a second. There's a reason why I made the sign. 
Sign. Sign. There we go. And edit the sign. Home sweet home. Save. Close. Alright, now. Now we put the back wall up here. Alright. Here we go. It's looking good. It's looking good. It's so dark over here on this side of the this side of things. But not anymore. We put down a torch. Some walls. There we go. And a table. And a chair. And where's my door? There we go. There we go. Yeah. Nice little home for a demolitionist to move into. And let's give him a little bit of walking room here, though. There we go. Yeah. Of course, the demolitionist will be at uh, definite risk of attack from uh, red moons. Uh, because zombies will come over here, kick his door open, and try to kill him. But we'll deal with we're going to make this whole area much more defensible here in the not-too-distant future. Matter of fact, I might uh, move the whole operations of things to a new location. I haven't decided yet exactly what I'm going to do. Actually, my whole thing here is sort of poorly defensible against uh, red moons. I have, I'm, I'm sort of amazed. On other videos, red moons are happening all the time. But I haven't encountered a red moon once. That's a good thing, I guess. But I was I was sort of hoping for it. Let's go back over this way. We're going to... No. I know corruption's over that way, and I don't have the resources to deal with corruption. I sort of want to get more eyeballs killed, because I think I do have pretty much all the resources I'll need to fight the eyeball boss and win. Except one set of resources here that I think would be very useful. Let's uh, go ahead and get those right now from the merchant shop. Where, 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 where's he got them? Where's he got them? Right here. Oh, come on. There we go. See, I can do this. 250. That is plenty. Put my money back. There. See? Let's close that door. Open the door. Let's go. Let's go find some eyeballs. Eyeballs that want to be poked. Where are we going? Where are we going? Over this way. Eyeballs. Hello. No, you're not an eyeball. You're a zombie. Do you even know that you're a zombie? You were a zombie. Hmm. Yeah. Ooh, eyeball. Come on. Fight me. Fight me. on. Fight me. Fight me. Fight. Fight. Fight like, fight like an eyeball. Well, I guess you are fighting like an eyeball. Fight like something stupider. Because you're already pretty retarded. Fight stu Fight even more stupid. Oh, that's... Yeah. Jumping over you, ha ha! You can't get me. You can't get me. You can't get me either. You can't get me either. I have no interest in fighting zombies. Zombies give me nothing but money. Money's good, but it's not as useful as, say, lenses, which I can use to make amazing things. 
mainly. An eyeball for a boss. Oh, you know what else I need to find? I need to find an altar that I can use to even combine those things. Whoa. Whoa, so many zombies. So many zombies. There we go. Okay. Where are we at here? Didn't I f didn't I find one? I thought I, f I thought I found a glowy thing of an altar while I was doing some exploration earlier, but maybe I'm mistaken. I thought I did. And I, I thought I said something along the lines of, oh, better remember where that is. And then I think I promptly forgot. But maybe I didn't. Maybe I was watching somebody else's uh, YouTube and I thought, they have an altar right there and they should probably remember where that is. One of those two things is likely the case. Um, I might have to watch my own videos and figure out if uh, I did find an altar or not. Ah, zombies are coming out of the cave. It's not a red moon. Why are there so many zombies? This has been a distinct lack of uh, eyeballs. Oh, okay, so I, ca I can jump with the boots. It's just if I encounter like one little block like that that stops me, the boots stop uh, being useful. I think this is as far as I've ever gone. Ooh, eyeballs! Come on. Come on and down. The annoying thing is, like, if I wanted to fight zombies and it turned day, the zombies might try to get away, but I can easily corner them in places and keep them stuck. Eyeballs, though, if it turns day, they just turn around and go away. Which is useful if I don't want to be fighting them, but it's very hard to get the eyeballs stuck in a place to uh, continuously fight them. Alright. Eyeballs died. I got one lens from all those eyeballs. That. That was such a useful use of my time. Well, one lens is better than none. I am finding a lot of falling stars. That's good. Maybe I'll get some more mana. Hey, if anybody has any advice on a good way to find the demon altars, uh, that'd be appreciated. I understand that they are can be found inside of... Uh, uh, what, what am I trying to say? The pits for corruption? But, uh, I'd rather not have that be my demon altar is one from a pit in corruption. Because corruption is annoying to try to deal with without the proper gear. Ooh, daytime. Well... That means no more falling stars to find, no more eyeballs to find. Ooh. That looks like a pit. Like, it looks sort of like a corruption pit, but it's... I'm not in corruption, so... I wonder where that goes. I might have to explore in there, but... Ooh. Sand pit. And... Am I near the end of the world? Is that why I'm seeing sand? Nope. Nope. Guess not. Maybe now I am. Oh. Look at that. I hit it just enough to break one block, and I got three blocks from that. That's crazy. That's definitely a glitch. Ah, jeez. How come every time my 
boots activate, the world throws one little block in my way. And I understand this is the end of the world. I'm just verifying. Yeah, I need to get to the top. I don't know. I think I went too deep. I don't know if I'm going to make it. Have a potion ready. Yeah, I made it. That's right. You can use a potion to get to the surface. I mean, it might not uh, might not be the perfect thing in the world, but it's definitely better than drowning. Oh, that's the sand pit. I wasn't interested where the sand pit goes. That probably just oh, it's Pinky. Pinky, you need to die. Hopefully, I can. Uh, hopefully, I can kill Pinky and be far enough away that I can see what he drops. Demolitionist has arrived. Yay! Come here, Pinky. Come here. Come here. You know what's weird? Okay, who else has actually looked at the screenshots of Terraria on the like official website? They show a little bunny on the surface, bunny looking thing, but I haven't seen a bunny thing in any of the Let's Plays that I've watched. I haven't seen it in, uh, in any tr tr the bunny in any trailers. I haven't found it myself. So does the bunny actually exist? Is it something that's coming in the future? I don't know. If anybody ever sees the bunny, let me know. Um, get a screenshot of it, please, because that would be amazing. Um, yeah. Bunnies. Because I want to know what's up with the bunny. Is it, is it a joke, or is it an actual monster? Is it a hostile monster? Is it, uh, is it a friendly monster that, uh, is just a cute little thing you might occasionally see and kill anyways because it's cute? I don't know. These are all seemingly important questions to me right at this very moment. Uh, yeah, I seem to have gotten myself stuck in a pit. Uh, it doesn't seem to have anything amazing. It's, uh, I mean, it's got ore right here, but I don't care about bronze. Or, or, not bronze. This game doesn't have bronze. I don't care about copper really much anymore, other than for making amazing walls. There might be, there might be little things that I can make that I don't know about that require copper, and I'll probably look into that. I understand I can make a watch, but I think that requires gold, not copper. So yeah, if anybody knows of anything amazing that I can make from copper, oh, if anybody knows anything I can make from copper uh, that I don't already have, that be go ahead and let me know. Um, but I think I'm going to end the episode here. I'm actually going to quit the game for right now and then come back later and play some more. But what have I done? Three episodes back to back and got myself caught in a pit. So yeah, I'm going to quit and next time you'll find me at my spawn point. I might uh, do some stuff off screen like uh, fine tune my uh, village that I've been building up. Make it a little bit more defensible from... Uh, crazy attacks i might even make it look uh, impressive but uh or maybe you guys want to see that stuff if you guys want to see that stuff go ahead and let me know um but uh let's see here uh yeah that's that's what i have to s say to you guys um if you're curious what i'm doing right now it's uh digging out that stone so i can stand right here i am at level zero this is sea level right here yeah i'm at sea level all right well I'll see you guys later. Go ahead and let me know how you like things. Or don't. That's, that's all on you guys. I mean, it's appreciated, but... Uh, yeah. Alright. Where's the quit button? There it is. Good night, everybody.